Hello again guys, welcome back to Hammer and Anvil Gaming. This is my Total War Free Kingdoms Lubu Legendary campaign. Uh, and when we left off, we continued expanding um, in the north. We took Huazin um, from in the Hainai Commandery. And we'd also defeated and employed Ji Ling, who lost to uh, Sheng Zhang in a glorious battle, which was pretty one-sided, but it saved us unnecessary casualties. Um, so now we probably want to move along here and take and move into Luling uh, Commandery. Hmm. This army we don't need to worry about because it's got spies embedded in it. Um, so let's actually let's move there, and then we should be able to take that next turn with no problem. Uh, Machao can finish off this place. We just used some of our momentum to coerce another faction into a trade agreement, despite the fact that they hate us. Um, so that's helped our economy a bit. But let's take this. I hate that it always makes you want to annex something. I don't want to do that. Oh. So it doesn't look like we can reach him this turn, so let's replenish. Uh... Yeah, okay. It's annoying how the AI just walks past your armies to go for your your like juicy underbelly. Um, okay, we took Kwazin. Um, we can probably quickly hop across. Is there any crossing points? Uh, one up there. We can probably hop across and take Ying Xuan back. Uh, spies. What's going on with our spies? Um, okay, so she's still... She fled along with the army up here. Um, and then, did we manage to... So it looks like we've successfully pissed off enough of their... Fa their uh, oh, pardon me. Enough of their um, characters so that a lot of them have left. Their family tree doesn't make any sense to me. If I remember correctly, maybe it's changed now, but when I looked at it earlier, um, so it looks like they came from Si Xi, but Shi Yu Meng has married Wang Xi. That's the heir, is a kid, so it just leaves her. Who's regent? Right, okay, that makes sense. And he's the administrator of Yu Lin. Oh, which is down here. Yeah, that's there. Okay, so everyone's reasonably unhappy now because of recent events. So you can probably start to actually discredit individual characters now. I assume that stacks. Uh, I don't think you can do discredit faction multiple times. Maybe you can. So this is here, the only one who can do it is Kuai Liang, who is our spy. So they're going to both work together to create discontent, I guess. Okay, we're low on cover, so on undercover networks. Let's build it. So let's check next turn. Oh, it happened immediately. Is it because it's a different spy, I guess? Oh. Oh, 
I'm going to wait till next turn because our cover is getting a bit low. But that's interesting. We've already managed to get rid of another faction, another character. Really, we want another army, but I can't really justify it at this point. Uh, let's upgrade the trade port here. It's relatively safe. And our capital's upgrading, so that's good. Let's check out our air a sec. So that gives test. I, I found this in my own campaign. So this raiment of nobility can give an additional 10 satisfaction faction wide. So if we give her the dignified raiment, and then if we also give her um, this war axe, which we'll take from Cheng Pu. Boom, we got an additional 10 satisfaction. Awesome. Okay, so he's got pretty decent... Ooh, perfection. Sovereign of Blades. Interesting. That's pretty cool. Yeah, who else are administrators? Uh, we got one at Luo Yang. And she's got the plus 10% commerce buff. Uh, title, sorry. Yeah, she's alright. She's she's fine. Um, and then Huainan was pretty good as well, wasn't it? He's fine. All right, let's send this in. Okay, Liu Bei's coming in hot now with a lot of troops. I don't like our chances here, to be honest. They've got three units of Zhan, Zhan Magian infantry, which will just ruin us. Uh, I'm going to just delegate that. There's no chance we're going to win that. Hang on, so we don't get to bring our spies in unless we fight with another army. Okay, that changes things then. I'm going to have to go back and deal with that now, that sucks. Uh, let's side with Jiling. What? Uh, 
Why did she return? Did she... Oh, she just lost all of her satisfaction, I guess. Oh, she could have been released as a counter-spy, potentially. Maybe. That could be a problem. Better keep an eye on her. Dianwei is cheerful. Nice. Zhang Hong has gained rank. And so is Liu Zhang Zhen, who is our faction heir, which is great. Uh, plus five faction support. That's pretty good. Uh, yeah, let's do plus five faction support for now. Zhang Zhang Hong can have flaming shot because we need that on our trebuchets. Okay, so we're actually struggling with food now. Um, Mm hmm. Uh, oh, there's no point not taking this place. Uh, can Dian Wei catch them here? Oh, he can. They're in trouble now. Uh, don't really want a feather fan. Let's just release her. And Huang Quin Fang's got nothing of value to steal, so let's just release her for the 800 ransom. And then we'll get maintain momentum and finish them off. Okay, so we destroyed her faction. Interesting. Right, let's see if we can catch this guy. Let's just gobble up some more territory here. Ah, uh, I think I, t I owned this before, didn't I? Yeah. Um, okay, come back to that in a sec. Right, so how are spies doing? Okay, so it looks like the 20 is as far as it's going to go. Is 
Zengbo looks unhappy. Liu Jit's gonna go. Sen Sheng's gonna go. So let's see if we can discredit more characters. Let's get rid of Sen Cheng. Nope, can't do that. Zengbo, nope, can't do that. Hmm. Can he do it? So why can he do it? I don't understand that. Oh well, that'll do for sure. Okay, so Sen Cheng is now gone. Gonzo. We could try and get rid of Wang Shi. He's a family member as well. Oh, close. So that's obviously him maxed out. So I guess it's minus 10 for the discredit factions. So you get that minus 10 per spy, effectively. And then you can get an additional minus 30 from discredit factor. Faction. Um, discredit character, sorry. So can I not do this go again? Does it stack again? Can't do, right? Yeah, so it, it can't stack twice. But we could make someone else unhappy. Like Zengbo. And then, are there any new... Yuan Shu is a spy for Hu Mao, who we are trading with now. Interesting. So he probably would be a good spy, actually, so let's deploy him. Serving in office. Uh, let's build our undercover network uh, and commit to that. Oh, so Yuan Shu is in the family. <laughs> let's have a look at this. Uh, Hu Mao, there we go. Oh. Ah, I see, okay. So we could actually improve relations with them. Because they hate us. Let's cancel that. That's a dumb thing to do, right? Let's leave that for now. We'll come back to one shout, one shout, one shoe later. Um, who has still got movement points? Doesn't look like anyone along here has movement points still. Um, Uh, let's, I think we're probably better off speeding up military infrastructure here, aren't we? So, if we instant construction it. Hmm. 
I'm going to just, just do it at once, actually. And then we also want to build an inn and potentially a market wharf. Uh, and let's go ruin this. Oh, actually, no, 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 no. Let's get Lu Bu to go ruin this guy's day. How? Oh, yeah, we get reinforcements. Ha! <laughs> Oh, yeah, he's in the wrong place. Oh, come on. Pyrrhic victory. How is that going to be? Ugh. We've got reinforcements coming in. Every uh, okay, right. Let's start the battle. They've got some heavy cavalry, I will admit. That does look scary. So they're probably going to come towards us, as always, um, because they have um, the range disadvantage. So that's all that grouped, um, and then where do we want the tower to go? I guess we put the tower here. Uh, put some cavalry traps here. Don't think we need the fire pit. And let's start the battle. Let's go. Let's get away from that cavalry. Where is this awesome looking unit? Jan Cavalry Captain. No. Imperial Household Cavalry. Thank you. 
Move a bit forward. Trying to get that household cavalry. Let's uh, see if we can take some pot shots at that. Um, mm. Yeah, let's see if we can take some pot shots at that Jan infantry captain C. Xiu,我知道你能行。或许你该考虑如何破阵杀敌。敌军仓皇逃窜，一群懦夫。准备就绪。敌一战，完成不屈，刀枪不入。奇迹一致。Uh, Lubu's already got here in time. Yeah, we don't actually need all of our units over here. Let's see if we can snipe some of the generals. Oh, where's Lu Bu going? He's going after the wrong unit. <laughs> oh dear.
胜利近在咫尺。All right, I think we got this piece of cake. Stop the artillery fire for a bit. Hmm. Don't want to take too much damage from that tower. Oh, we got him. Cool. Release her for the ransom. And then. Mm, yeah, let's maintain the ransom. Uh, well, actually. Mm, Move him in there. And while I think about what to do next, we can either move into Hidong and get some replenishment, or we can just charge ahead and take these guys out this turn, which would get us a back up in momentum, actually. Yeah, I'm going to think on that. Hope you enjoyed this one, guys. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next part.